Hi there everyone, this is Mario from M Studio and welcome to a new episode of Learning to Go. Today in the menu we have Dynamics with Cinema 4D. Dynamics are a great way to animate fast and in a realistic way and in Cinema 4D is really easy. I have this cube, I right click on it and select Simulation Tags Rigid Body. If I bring it up and hit play, as you can see it starts to fall. And this is already amazing. But it doesn't have a floor to land on. So let's add one and right click on it too. Selecting simulation tags again, but collider this time. Let's go back to frame zero. This is extremely important. And hit play again. There we go. Now it bounces on the floor. Speaking of bounces, you can also control how the object should react when colliding. If you click the dynamic tag on the cube and go to the collision tab, you can for instance increase the bounce amount of the object. If I move it to 100%, go back to the first frame, again this is very important, and hit play, it is going to bounce way more. Another key option is the shape. This actually changes the way the object shape is accurately taken into account. If you want an object to behave correctly, change to the more precise and time-consuming option Moving Mesh. Take a look at the difference. The green one set to Moving Mesh has a way more realistic reaction during the collision, based on its actual shape. Another fun option is to apply a soft body to an object instead of a rigid one. I'll right click on a new object and select Simulation Soft Body. Hit play and pow. <laughs> there are many other options in Dynamics, but these are the basics that will allow you to get freely further. If you want to understand what all the other options are for, never hesitate to right click somewhere in the Cinema 4D interface and select Show Help. The manual is extremely well done and as soon as you grab the main idea of a technique, as you do now with dynamics, it's very easy to master the details. Of course, don't hesitate either to write your questions and thoughts in the comment section, to subscribe to be the first to know when a new tutorial is out, and this is it for today's episode of Learning To Go, my name is Mario from M Studio, and I think that if I see you again, it's probably gonna be next time. Ciao!